Police have arrested a suspect in the murder of a nun from Wisconsin. Sister Margaret Held of the School Sisters of St. Francis and another nun were found stabbed to death in their home in Mississippi on Thursday. Police arrested a man for the double murder early this morning. 46-year-old Rodney Earl Sanders of Kosioko, Mississippi is charged with two counts of capital murder. A double homicide. This is about the worst thing that can happen to us since Katrina. The women were found stabbed in their home, a back door ajar, apparent victims of a robbery gone wrong. Their missing car discovered a mile away. Their death is a shock to us, as you can imagine, and we're uh, we're just deeply grieved. Police say Sanders was a person of interest early on, and after an exhaustive interview Friday evening, they had enough to charge him. But it won't bring back two loving members of this community in mourning. They were the most beautiful women that have ever drawn a breath into their bodies. They were totally giving of themselves to everyone. They were well known by only their first names, Sister Margaret and Sister Paula. They'd long ago settled in one of the nation's poorest counties with one wish, to serve. We make a difference in people's lives, and we never know what that difference is. Mm -hmm. For many of little means in the region, the nuns, both 68, were the only health care providers some residents had ever known. The nurse practitioners serving as doctors, therapists, and friends. We just see patients and do what needs to be done. A wake for Sister Margaret and Sister Paula will be held in Mississippi tomorrow, and a memorial mass is scheduled for Monday.